otherwise known as Cincinnati Gin. Uh, we're in the city of Wyoming on Tuesday, so that means it's Farmer's Market Day. I wanted to bring you down here, show you some of the different vendors that they have, uh, what makes them unique, what makes this Wyoming Farmer's Market so special. Um, I hope that you enjoy. If you have any questions, not only about the Farmer's Market, but about this area in general, Sure. And I'm Britt Hedges, and we're the co-owners of the Wyoming Ave Farmers Market. Started our sixth season here in Wyoming. Please. The reason we started the market here, um, we are both residents of Wyoming. We met through the newcomers group, and just felt that there was such a great sense of community, and that farmers markets are our venues for continuing that sense of community and building. We both moved here from other parts of the country okay. and had shopped regularly at farmer's markets in the areas where we lived before and loved the ability to choose the foods we bought from. What makes our market different from some of the other ones around is that we can take, we can do electronic transactions. We can take Visa, MasterCard, even um, Ohio Direction for people who are recipients of those benefits. Basically, you just come to our market tent if you've got a, a credit card, swipe the credit card. For $20, you get 19 $1 tokens. They're good at all the vendors. They're good every day, every week, every year. We've had people find them underneath the car mats and bring them the following season. So it's just another way that we help to make it easier for people to shop and support the vendors. Okay. How long have you been down in Wyoming Farmer's Market? This is the beginning of our third year. Nice. You're highly desired. I mean, I've heard many people say, we have to get the fireside pizza. So what do you do that makes you so unique? Um, well, that's a big part of it. The brick oven. The traveling brick pizza oven. What would you want somebody who's never been to the Wyoming Farmer's Market to know about you and about the market itself? Um, just that we're always trying to use kind of what's fresh in that market, and I think the one good thing about this market that I can tell you that's different about other markets is Brent and Penny. A smaller market, I think that it is one of the more, it's one of the higher quality markets in Cincinnati. Excellent. Perfect. Thank you so much, Mike. I'm Sandy Ashmore, and I'm from that guy's family farm. And my husband's name is Guy, so that's how we got at getting the farm name. So sometimes I could be that girl. And I think this might be our sixth year. So I always enjoy coming down here. I would have certified organic produce and cut flowers. Right. Andy's Backyard Bees, and we're here at the Farmer's Market in Wyoming. We've been here probably about four years now, and we've been <laughs> beekeepers for about seven. Oh, yeah. <laughs> really enjoying the crowd. Okay. Kind of fun to get together with the, the uh, people here in town, and we always look forward to come down on Tuesdays to just be part of the crowd here. Excellent. What are the hours of the farmer's market? Uh, three until seven. I think she, Actually, I think it's quarter of three until seven now, so there should be plenty of time to get down here. Absolutely. Well, let's look at some of the product that you have to offer. Cool. All right. And we, we brought our bees with us today. That's pretty neat. What are we looking at here? This is a uh, one frame of bees from one of our hives. We have about 15 hives here. Some are in town, some are in Hartwell. Okay. And this is just one of the hives that bees we have. And these are some of our products. We have uh, honey in different shapes and sizes, the smaller, the larger, glass for those who like glass only. Nice. And uh, we'll be here hopefully every week throughout the summer. Perfect. Thank you so much. Skirts and Johnston Fine Pastries and Chocolates. We're located in Finley Market and we come down here every Tuesday with bread and sweets. Um, we have all kinds of cookies. We've got blondies, lemon bars. We've got about 100 loaves of bread every Tuesday. Nice. We've got salted rye, butter crust, sourdough, garlic asiago, purple wheat raisin. And we'd really like if you come down, come down and see us. This market is really excellent. They've got a wide, diverse variety of different vendors that are available. Uh, let me show you some of the things that I picked up. Today I got um, a bag of spinach. Pretty awesome. It's totally organic. And I also got a tomato plant. I'm pretty excited about this tomato plant because then that means uh, we can make our own salsa at home and then our own tomatoes for a salad. And then also, I got down here at the bottom a little thing of honey. I'm pretty excited about putting this in my teeth. So, anyway, um, just wanted to share with you some of the different things that make this farmer's market so unique and some of the different vendors. I hope that you enjoy and take care. Thanks for watching.